Welcome back. We're looking at another cosine function and actually it's very similar to what we had a moment ago. We just now also have an added 3. So what do we got? Cos of 3x. Very ugly looking cos I wrote, but cos of 3x. And we're told that's equal to 1 again. So, we're going to start the same way as before. We want to get and solve for x. Okay, well, take cos to the minus 1 of both sides. So cos to the minus 1 of 1. And what do we get? These cancel. We get 3x equals 0 again. Cos to the minus 1 of 1 is 0. If I want to, I can put brackets. Well, that means x will be equal to 0. Divide both sides by 3. 0 divided by 3 equals 0. Or 3 divided by 3 cancels. 0 divided by 3 is still 0. So x equals 0. The same answer as before. But just like before, we have to remember it's periodic. But that's where this 3 now really affects things. Of course, it could have affected things if my answer wasn't 0 here, but I'm choosing the same example to drive this home. We looked at before, the period is 2 pi for the normal cosine or sine or tan function. Well, with this 3, it influences it. What our period is, is 2 pi divided by this number right here. They often represent it with a k, so it's 2 pi over k is the period. In our previous one, k was 1, so we just had 2 pi. Well, in this case, the period is 2 pi over 3, or 2 over 3 pi. That's how often it repeats itself. It makes it repeat itself faster. It's so repeating itself more often as we go along our line. Still repeating itself an infinite number of times, but it's just crunching it inwardly. So, this is going to repeat itself, and we can think once again that every, well, let's go back to this color, n, in this case, 2 pi over 3 is what x is going to equal. Because at, when it's 0, again, n is an integer, n is an integer, and it's just every 2 pi upon 3, whatever that is, we could convert it to a number if we wanted, pi is just 3.14, so we could convert this over and see it's just every, greater, every bit over 2, it would be repeating itself, and we'd get this whole function equal to 1. So there is again infinite number of solutions, it's just we influence the period with this number right here. How often it repeats itself. When it repeats itself. It's no longer a 2 pi, now it's a 2 pi over 3. So it repeats itself sooner. And that's in both directions, remember. Minus and plus. So, we're all done.